hails from Cincinnati, Ohio. He is known as The Problem. Ladies and gentlemen, here he is, Adrian Broner. Adrian Broner. The Problem. How you gonna mess up my name? I said the problem. Get, get the mic out of his hand. Adrian, <laughs> 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 like you just had one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the first big event to come back to the city after Sandy. I'm just glad and thankful that I can really come to AC and put on a show like I'm going to do tomorrow. That was a moment of a lifetime. Just to be in there with those kids, um, knowing what they're going through. Everybody say, going to work with the problem. Wait, going to work with the problem. I know some of their houses probably been ripped down, tore down. Just to see those smiles. They started like, hanging on me. One was on my this shoulder, and this shoulder it was fun. Your income is rapidly rising. Your star is getting bigger. You're on the cover <laughs> of Ring Magazine. Uh -huh. Your World Championship Boxing on HBO. Uh -huh. Does it get any harder to keep going in and doing the same kind of hard, disciplined work that you've done for a dozen years? No, I mean, this is what I do. Everybody's like, this is going to be the toughest test. This is going to be the toughest test. But every time I go back and look, look, at, look at the results, it, it's looking like it's getting easier. Yeah. Is DeMarco here? Uh -huh. Can't go out there and ask you, man. Maybe I have to bite down and, and really, really dig this fight. I'm ready for it. Ladies and gentlemen, first to the scales, here is the challenger, Adrian the Problem Rogner. One, three, four, and one half. It don't matter who they put on the other side of the ring. I will be victorious, and I will do whatever, whatever it takes to get the victory. That we're not ready. I know. How much time? Five. We can't give you ten. Five minutes. Well, we're gonna be ten. Five minutes. Hey, hey, ain't none of y'all in there fighting. We gonna be ten. Y'all ain't waking up running eight and a half miles in the morning. When I'm walking towards the ring, I'm just so ready to perform. I love to put on a show camp for two and a half months. You gotta eat right, run eight and a half miles, sometimes nine. You can't have this. You can't have cake. Can't be around your girl, no sex. You go to the fight, you like, somebody gotta pay for this. In the big picture, this fight is big. Go. 
touchdown victory. Even though I don't listen to the critics, I'm my biggest critic. Looking at guys like Floyd and Pacquiao and Ali and the Sugar Rays, I really have a lot more to go out there and conquer. I got the whole world of boxing in front of me. All I gotta do is grab it and it'll be mine. So it's all up to me.